Guys, uh, it is I, Jane Poopio, with a brand new playthrough. And this time, we are going to start off with we're gonna be doing a Super Mario 3D World for the Nintendo Wii U and Nintendo Switch because this is the version of the game. This is the Switch version, the Bowser's Fury version. So, yeah, this game came out back in 2013, 2013. Um, and it was a massive hit. Everyone loved this. So, yeah, this was really awesome. Awesome game back then. I love it to this day. And, yeah, I'd say it's better than 3D Land. So, yeah. So, let's just get started, shall we? Now, this because this is the Switch version, it is slightly different. Uh, so, we can choose four characters here. Mario, Luigi, Toad, or Peach. I'm gonna go with Mario for start. And then we get a cutscene. Yep, Mario, Luigi, Peach, and Toad all walk up. And then they find this pipe. And they fix it. But then, a lot of things came out, and then a fairy. Oh no! All right, guys, we're back. What's she freaking out about? Oh, Bowser is literally plagiarizing the Legend of Zelda by capturing fairies in bottles. <laughs> okay. And now Bowser is a genie! Okay, just kidding. He kind of looks like it. he comes from. I don't know. He kind of looks like a genie from there because of his legs. And then he goes down. Hello, <laughs> Luigi's like, ah, I'll go last. Pipe's gone. And yet, yeah, now we're on the world map. So you can see, all we can do is go to a level, or oh, and get this coin at least. You can chase away the bird, I wanna eat you! Okay, just kidding. All we can do is go to this first level right here. And then here, you can either change your character, or we can just continue on. We're just going to continue on. So, Super Mario 3D World. This is how the game controls. It's basically jump and run. You run very fast. I don't remember running this fast in the original, but oh well. Not that it matters. And we're going to get the cat suit, which we can scratch enemies and climb up walls. Uh, so, we're going to... I'm gonna just speed through this level and we can carry our items. And the green stars is what you collect. So not like in Galaxy 2, no, don't worry. So kind of like in Galaxy 2, but not too much. You go in this clear pipe, that's what these are. For this. It's a checkpoint. And then if you can see the goal is there. And then here there's a bunny! We can just chase it. I think they're a lot easier to chase in the Switch version, it seems, because we're running fast. Let's go in the pipe. And then we find a stamp. Stamps are also important. Because they have one. Like, not really... Not really important, but 
Important 100% to get him. Oh, I got hiccups. Before we go up there, let's just go up here. We have a clock and then a massive bunny. Scratch him. Okay, we got him. And then we're massive Mario. We're just going to go down here. I don't think there's anything down here. Can we get more of these? No. Okay. We go through here. Kill these cat goomers. And we need to go down here. And yes, it does expire. Like there. It did expire there. So we're just going to go through here with the cat suit. The good thing about the cat suit is that you can also cheat flagpoles, as you can see here, because we're going to go up to the flagpole. Well, we made it to the top, but we can also climb to the top. <laughs> yep, there's a lot of meowing in this game. Oh, the stamps are in colour this time, okay. Because in the original, they were just in black and white. So yeah, there's a, quite a few differences with the Switch version here, because I'm on the Switch version. Oh, no autosaving this time, I think. Or maybe it does autosave, but there's no text saying that the game is saving. Well, at least that saves time. Uh, or do we have to save manually? Because we can press save. Now I'm playing, okay. I'm going to overwrite this file. Okay, so I think it does autosave, because I saw it's 18.50 there, because that's the time it is. And it's literally 51 on my PC clock now, so... Okay, so yeah. There's other options. What are the other options? Oh, just camera. Alright. Alright, let's go to Cooper Trooper Cave. Now... You can also change your character here. I'm gonna do Luigi this time. So... Uh, because every character has different stats. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, I'm gonna... I'm gonna go through there. And here, we can easily, uh, do the one-up trick here. There we go! Lots of one-ups! The trick still works here today. But I'm gonna have no time, I'm not gonna have any time to do that today, so I'm just gonna not do that. So I'm gonna go this way. Uh, and our first green star is there. Whoa, okay. Let's go up here to go in this mystery box. And we're just gonna kill these Koopa Troopers. For a, s uh, for a green star, I was about to say star coin, but no, I was speaking of 3D land. But I'm not on 3D land anymore, I'm on 3D world. And I think there was something up there, but no matter. You can also hold different directions to go to different directions in clear pipes, which is what you'll want to do a couple of times. There's a stamp in here, so we're going to get that. It's a good thing we're Luigi, because we could easily do this. So we can easily do this. Nice! Got that, and then I'm gonna go this way. Here. We're on top of the flagpole. Yeah. Now, in order to uh fully complete the game you'll want to beat every stage with every character so we'll want to do every stage with every character so yeah oh and then we have like a mini boss sort of uh so we can see here oh oh we got a one up nice uh, we're going to go to this toad house to see what there is. You can't change character here. Uh, it's a toad house. Pick a box. It can't it help you on your way. So we just choose a box. And this one has tons. So we've got fire flower and a uh, cat suit. So yeah. Burn the toad. Ha <laughs> ha. 
Okay, so yeah. I thought the game crashed then, but no, it didn't. And you can change your camera directions. Oh, it does also save. I can see the saving icon was down there. Do, 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 do. So now we're going to go... Oh, there's a hidden coin there. I'm going to go to this area. Also, these levels have certain names. This one is Super Bell Hill. This one is Cooper Trooper Cave. This one is Charging Chuck Blockade. This one is. You also press start or select to randomly select a character. We got Mario! I'm just going to kill him. There we go. Boom! They're kind of easy stages to do. So yeah. Just easily go through them with ease. Boom, we, we got him. And now we got this stage. Which is... Mount Beanpole. I think that's what it's called. Yeah, Mount Beanpole. Uh, so, the first star coin, I think it's up here. Oh, yes, it is. I was correct. I thought I, I thought there wasn't, but yes, there is. Uh, so then, uh, whoa, Mario. Oh, my God. Do, 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 do. And there's nothing up there, so totally fine with that. Oh, God. Oh, it replaced that. All right. Got you there. All right, I want to do that. There we go. And then go in this pipe, because in this pipe, we have a green star that we have to get with these. Yeah, I think we can confirm I am a lot faster than the original. And Toad is supposed to be the fastest. I don't know if this is like a mistake or something, but it, it kind of feels like I am fast. It's, this is faster than the original. Even accelerated might be. Not accelerating, but you know, uh, going up here is faster. Get that logo. We need to get the star. We need to get all the green stars. And then here. Oh, there's this cat paw thing. Which we use to get this up. Then we're going to climb this. And then go in this cloud. Which launches us up. And then we have these kind of stages. And then. I'm just going to go very fast. Kill all these enemies. Whee! <laughs> okay, we got everything here. Whoa! Okay, I'm just gonna defeat this piranha plant, and then boom, we are done with this level. You just climb up this, and then boom, we're on top. Lovely. And we got a cat goomba. And now we get two stages we unlock here. Oh, and there's something else I can show off in this area. Uh so have you tried connecting with playing with friends? Uh oh, no. Well, I don't have any friends with me, so we cannot do this. If I did, then we could make we, uh, we could do it like a collab play through. Um, there's this thing right here. What is this, you may ask? It's none other than the Toad House. Yeah. Oh, okay. I didn't really need that, but okay. But yeah, I guess I should have gone there if um, if I didn't have any. Um, uh, bells with me. So, 
We got this level and then this level. We're gonna go with this one first because this is the fourth one. This is this one is Plessy's Plungin Falls. So here we have Plessy, which is like a orange Yoshi. We have this fairy. And we just jump on him and then Hold on, Plessy, and head for the goal. Alright, oh, yeah. Yep, Mario 64 slider theme, but remix for this game. Uh, to sound like, uh, to sound like all modern. Uh, so yeah, the controls are simple here. I'm gonna get that star coin, there we go, we got that. Now, you'll have to do this stage twice to fully, to, to get everything here, so. Right, I missed one, doesn't matter. It's fine. Because, uh, because, uh, the, the, the second star and a stamp are in different locations. We're gonna get the second star first. So, the second star is through this way. You go through this waterfall, and then there it is. Meanwhile, the stamp is on that side, and we cannot get it. And we died. I should have jumped. I should have jumped, to be honest, but okay. Here we go again. Okay, so then we're just gonna go past these guys. Oh, oh, the second star coin's gotten already. Oh, I didn't know about the Switch version. Oh. So even though we've already gotten it, because I thought you have to get it again, but no. Okay, apparently it's new with the Switch version. So this time, I am going to get the stamp. Um, I guess it was a good thing I died then. I never knew that, because in the Wii U version, um, uh, every time you every time you get a star coin, if you haven't got it before, or a stamp, and then you die uh, before the checkpoint, you have to get it again. But in the Switch version, it doesn't seem to be the case. Because I've not played the Switch version yet until today. So yeah, that's kind of cool. Okay, we've got the stamp. So we can only do that. We only need to do this one one time then. Do, 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 do. Let's run, run, run with Plessy. Got the last star coin there. Whee! We're falling down. And then we stop here. And then he waves goodbye to us. But we will see Plessy again later on. So, yeah, we're just gonna go through here. Oh, I didn't get on top, but it doesn't matter. Now, I'm not gonna do this level again, because obviously, I'll just, uh, I'll just be wasting my time, but you also need to go on top of the flagpole to fully 100% as well, but it doesn't matter what character you do it as. So, yeah, that's a good thing. Uh, and I will do that off screen. You can tell if you've not got on top of the flagpole, because it'll just be a normal colour. Your normal character color depending on what you do it as so yeah and is my capture card acting up not surely really. okay let's go to oh okay it's acting up a bit i'll just um uh, i'll just go and sort that out a bit guys okay guys i'm back my apologies my capture card was being weird but it's not anymore so well it might act weird later but so far it isn't all right this one is a circus switch scramble circus And something from Super Mario Galaxy 1 and 2 are back. Switches. Yep. And then they turn green once you get them all. And the music changes after certain sections this time. So it's kind of a cool gimmick to these stages. So we're gonna... Oh, this time, you can jump on, on it and over again. Uh, but unlike Galaxy, where you would have to s uh, step off it and then, and then get on it, but okay. And then up here we have the star coin. So then here, uh, is there anything down here? Not down here, no. 
So I'm just gonna... Oh god. Oh! Oh, oh god. And we killed all these ladybugs. I'm gonna go this way. Oh, let's see if we can get anything from this. Oh, I've overrided that. Alright, it don't matter. So then in here, we need to find the star coin. Uh, star coin, I mean, green star, I mean. Got it. I'm gonna go up here. Oh god, that was so close! Oh god! I'm gonna try and get that. Do, 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 do. Right. And then we're gonna go this way for the final part of the music. The way you get the stamp, just go up here like that. Yes. These circus stages are kind of fun, especially with the music having their own gimmick. So yeah. All right, now we've gotten every normal stage done, but you notice Captain Toad is over there. We're gonna give him a visit. Oh, but we've got something else first. <laughs> okay, never mind. All right, we got something else first. This slot machine, yes, gambling in a kid game. So here we go. We're gonna start off this. You want to win seven seven coins? So you're just gonna match things. If you match four of the same thing, you'll get seven 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 coins. So yeah, these are kind of cool stages. So yeah. So now, let's go and visit Captain Toad, shall we? Because... Oh, this is new. So Captain Toad goes forth. This is called, I never knew the intro was longer this time. Instead of, instead of Captain Toad instantly going like, MAKE A PICTURE! Even though I think he says time for adventure, but it kind of sounds like he's saying make a picture. It sounds like I always thought he said that as a kid, but no. So with these Captain Toad missions, you cannot jump. You can do that, which I think is pluck things off the ground, even though we're not playing Captain Toad Treasure Tracker, even though it uses the same engine as this. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. So we just want to get every star coin, and you have to get every star coin to finish these missions. So yeah. Do -do 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 -do. Do -do -do. So then, and then the last star coin's there. Present. Okay. <laughs> that sounds like he's saying. <laughs> there was a ladybug in the background as well. Wow. Twenty-one we have so far. Use, yeah, I know, I know that. Um. Okay, yeah. So now we're gonna go. Well, first there's this. Uh, there's this thing. How much does it need? It needs ten to unlock. So now we're gonna save this green fairy from the intro. Bowser's Highway Showdown. Oh boy. Similar intros from 3D Land. Oh, but we have these football bombs. And you just kick them to then make them explode everywhere. So now we're just going to do this. 
We gotta start away from these uh, green coins. Do, 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 do. Okay, we're gonna keep being this Cat Mario. Because we can do this. I recommend using Cat Mario with these footballs because then, or soccer balls, depending on what you want to say. And ah, you need it. Some damage. Okay, thank God. The music's slightly different than the original. But, okay. Oh no, 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 no! Oh my god, why did you do that? Why did you dive to the water? Oh my god. Here we go, getting the coins. Oh, of course, that's already been collected. Nice, there we go. Alright, there we go. Oh god. Woo! Alright, whoa, okay. You want this? Maybe you won't need that because then you just go up here and then you'll have a fear anyway. The last star coin is above these Goombas. We just need to kill some of them. And boom, we got it. Oh, look, there's an 8-bit Luigi in the background running! Oh my god! <laughs> Kick the soccer ball, or the football, depending on what you want to call it. And then, we go in here, prepare for the most ridiculous fight ever. As the first boss. Beep, beep! Bowser in a car! Yeah, he apparently got a driver's license to apparently afford his brand new car. But you know what? We're just gonna destroy him! <laughs> yeah, so painful, isn't it? The car's going the same speed! Oh my god! <sighs> now you can hit the car itself, but I recommend using this to hit Bowser because it deals it deals more damage. And it's faster. And then it will go all the way there, if you reach to an end. So then, it will just loop until you finish the fight. I don't know if you... Oh! 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 Where am I? I couldn't see where I was. No! It's off screen! Uh, you can jump on the balls as well, so then it will do the same thing. I'm going to try that. Oh, what? I never knew you could change the camera here. And apparently I'm sucking at this fight because I'm trying to rush. Alright, let's get in there. Alright, Bowser buddy. We're going to destroy your car. Jump on it. Boom! Oh yeah, we destroyed your car. We destroyed your car. So you fall in the water. <laughs> and he's off to space. All right. So now we just need to finish the level. Whoa! We skipped the clock. Oh my god. There's the fairy in the bottle because uh, Bowser really wants to pretend to be Ganon. Uh, okay, just kidding. I don't like Ganon kidnaps fairies anyway. Uh, I don't think he does. There might be a Zelda game based on that in the future, but who knows. We're gonna get on top and then BOOM! We saved the first Sprixie, which is what these things are. And it's Bowser! Okay. Alright, and then...
She made a clear pipe for us with just one shaky hammer. Okay. Okay, so, yeah, that's World 1 done. Now, again, just like with 3D World, 3D Land, I'm gonna do it based on level, world by world for each episode. Um, regardless of how long it is. So, on that note, next time on Super Mario 3D Land, we will go through the game, we will go through World 2, and hopefully we can find other things to do. So I shall see you guys in the next video where we take on World 2, Jape about. See you guys next time. Bye!